After parking our trusty steed at the end of Wireless Road, which is the same road that leads you to Imhoff Caravan Park. So you drive past the caravan park and you'll see this parking area on your left. Park your vehicle there and proceed onto the beach. It's a good 20 to 30 minute walk to the wreck and we fast forwarded this video to make it a little bit quicker to get there otherwise we could drag it out. I hope you enjoy the walk with us and um, I will speak to you again from the wreck. Just sit back, relax, enjoy the music and the sound of the waves. What strikes you most about this wreck is the boiler, the big round thing you see in front of us right now. It is visible from Chapman's Peak and don't forget this Nurek beach is a beautiful beach. It's 8 kilometers long and it's a fantastic walk. As you saw earlier, there are often horses on the beach, people walking their dogs, a lot of families come out here. It's a wonderful outing to come and explore the wreck and you will see a family or two in doing that while we're making this video. The amazing thing is the wreck has been here for 122 years as it went down in 1900 and look at the ribs you can see the whole formation on the outline of the vessel in the sand still it's absolutely amazing to be part of this history and uh, i really suggest you get the family little rucksack some cool drinks sunscreen the normal thing and come take a walk and explore this vessel for yourself You'll see how much fun the kids have actually playing on it. But do remember, it is rusty metal, so be careful how you tread. As you can see, the, the sharp edges sticking out of the stand could cause an injury quite easily. Just look at that, the whole shape of the wreck in the sand. Magnificent. All right, I hope you enjoy the rest of the video as we explore the wreck. And we'll take a short walk back and... Um, chase some seagulls and have a bit of fun on the way back.